Hey, what's up? Today I'm gonna show you how to do these crazy shockwave effects. Also make sure to subscribe the channel for more tutorials. 94.5% of you watch the videos but don't subscribe. Okay, let's get straight into the tutorial. First we need to separate our object from the background. For this duplicate your clip and select the Roto Brush tool. Now double click your new layer and start Roto brushing your object. When you are done click on freeze. Adjust the Roto brush settings for better results. We just separated our object from the background. Now it's time to add the shockwave. For this I will use my shockwave overlay pack. It contains 16 shockwave overlays with transparent backgrounds. For this clip I will use the three light blue shockwaves. Just drag the shockwave and drop it on your clip. As you can see it the background is transparent. These overlays also work for Premiere Pro. Now we want the effect to happen behind our subject. For this drag the shockwave below the roto clip. This looks nice already but we can make the shockwave even better by changing the mode. I usually use add or screen, always depends on the clip. The add mode looks good but the screen mode makes the shockwave melt more into the background. So I choose the screen mode. This is the result. You can move the shockwave clip around until it starts at the right position. Now it should look like this. Like the video if you want to see more of this content. Make sure to check out my shop for many more preset packs. Comment what tutorial you want to see next and thank you for watching.